In today's video, we can paint any item to life. Oh my god. Boys, just look at him. I'm gonna name him Robert. Amethyst God Apple! Can we paint our way to victory? Watch till the end to find out. Let's do this, boys. So first, let's get ourselves some wood. Oh wait, I got a stick from what? Oh yeah, I forgot. I think you can break leaves and get sticks. I don't know why that's cool to me, but I, we did it. The goal right now, guys, is to make a magical brush that be licking toes. Okay, well, not really. It doesn't be licking toes, but <laughs> it does something else that's really cool, and it's gonna allow us to wait. Oh my god. Hello, sheep. Don't worry, family of sheep. I will steal your skin in a second. <laughs> That's so weird to say. But first, let's get some cobbler stone. Boom. Okay, we got seven. I think it should be good enough. Let's place this down. Let's get ourselves an axe to ask the sheep a question. It's a deadly question. And boom, a stone pickaxe. Okay. All right, we got some starter items. But as I said, we need the brush and you. We basically need wool. So we need one more other than this one. So three in total. Oh, wait. Oh, no. I need one more wool. But like, you know, I don't want to kill his. Oh, this is this is rough, guys. No, I can't. Oh, no, I can't do it to him. He's so happy with this dad or mom or whatever. Is there another sheep? <gasps> there is! Ah, okay, that is so mean. I have to do it to craft this magic brush, okay? And now let's make what would be a wool pickaxe if we were probably doing another video. <laughs> One, two, and then three. And there you go. Wool pick. I mean, not wool pickaxe. Brush. Oh my god. It looks like a normal brush, guys. But gamers, if we break this crafting table. Hello, be full of honey. Damn, my boy's thick. You got them honey buns. Okay, anyways. If we go ahead and right click any block, let's just do uh, it literally does not matter. You have been chosen stone block. Boom. Oh my god. Bro, we're able to literally paint. Oh my god. And I think if I paint literally any item, we should get it. What, what do I need right now? I, I just want to start off with something kind of simple, but really overpowered. Let's do uh, a diamond pickaxe. So I'm going to make the tip like right here and then the rest of the stick down here. And then, oh dude, I'm telling you guys, I have been practicing. Okay, wait, that looks really wrong. And just fill it in before anyone thinks it's something that's not. Okay, gamers, that's the stick. And then now if we go... Oh my god, perfect. Yeah, if we just eliminate green. I don't know how this works, okay? If you're confused, I'm confused. Okay, wait, this line came out pretty good. Okay, I feel like we can work with this. And then let's just like very poorly shade this in. And if we just hit done, then I'm pretty sure... Oh, wait. Oh my god. Boys. Oh my goodness. I literally have... Oh my god, look at it. It's my diamond pickaxe that we literally just painted. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Oh, wait, like what's the catch though? Is it is it literally just a diamond pickaxe? Like wait, hold on. I've never seen this before We painted a, a diamond pickaxe. We drew it whatever and now we can just use it. Oh my goodness We have the power of the painter. This brush is not some normal brush boys. Holy crap I think I did a pretty good job then wait. What if I just mine this block? Oh wait, nothing happens I don't know why the stone texture broke as well, dude this. Oh my god speaking of breaking boys I feel like we're gonna break the game. I mean we always do now. Hold on. It is nighttime. Should I get like dude? What should I get? I don't, I don't know. Like, bro, we literally have a diamond pickaxe that completely works. I mean, I don't know why it wouldn't work. Maybe because it's just a bunch of squiggly lines. Like, look at it. Oh my God. Wait, that means we can make armor. What else do we want to make though? Oh my God. We got to paint something else because boys, I'm trying to think. I honestly don't want to die. So <gasps> emeralds and wait, speaking of emeralds. Yeah, I don't want to die. So what if we make a totem of undying right off the bat? Like, hold on. Oh, okay, I missed completely. Almost died. I mean, if it's a real diamond pickaxe, we should be able to mine this emerald. Oh my God. I get it. It did work. Bro. I'm gonna box myself in just in case. I don't want any like creeper coming in out of nowhere. And then I really need food. Let's quickly. Boom. Okay. Pretty sure it's really easy. It's just like, oh God, that looks terrible. Okay, wait, that looks a lot better. Okay, so I'm just gonna make a bunch of like doodle stuff over here. <laughs> I don't know how this is gonna taste, boys. And then let's just fill this in. Okay, this kind of looks tasty. Mmm, yes, carrot. And okay, hold on. It, <gasps> it actually worked. Oh my God. Wait. What? I'm actually holding the golden carrot that we drew. Oh my god. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm literally Pablo Picasso. And wait, can I actually- Oh my god, I think I can actually eat it. Okay, it worked. I don't know if I ate pizza or a golden carrot, but it worked. Now, wait a second. Yeah, I don't even see any mobs. So I'm really not too worried about the totem of undying, but I think we should still make it just in case. So, okay, I'm just gonna make it right here. And then, oh god, you know this is gonna be awful. Okay, I think we're good. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm running, bro. I'm running. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Are you kidding me? Oh my god. Wait, it's perfect. <gasps> Wait! <laughs> Bro, bro, look at him. Look at our totem. What? Does it even work? I don't know. Should I test it? Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait, I'm actually gonna die. No, I'm not. I'm good. Why did we bring this thing to life? It's such a sad... Actually, it looks kind of happy. Just look at him. I'm gonna name him Robert. All right, Robert. You're gonna help us beat the game today. That's the goal. And now I need more food. Hold on a second. Wait, I think I have an idea. I think there's another item other than the brush that's gonna help us copy our already drawn items. And I'm pretty sure it's literally... Oh my god, I think I have enough wood. Boom, bam, 
one, and then bop. Okay, so now we have the stamp. Sneak, click, unblock with paint to copy. Oh my goodness, yes. Get out of my way, zombie. I need food. Bro, 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 you have to be kidding me. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Why is there actually so many zombies? Pretty sure I left my food pizza thing in here. Oh my god, yes, 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 yes. No! Where did this zombie come from? Oh my god, dude. Okay, there you go. We're good. I gotta get these zombies out of there. There you go. Boom. And then now we can just mine down and yes, eat my squiggly pickaxe. So if I grab the stamp and then I place it there. Boom. Yes. Oh my goodness. Okay, it worked. And if I just spam this, oh my god. <gasps> now we have five. Yo. Oh my god. <laughs> We have infinite pizza. That's really weird to call golden carrots pizza, but I honestly could use a better weapon as well. Oh my God. I need a drawn sword, bro. No, 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 no. <gasps> oh my goodness. Bro, I had to use it. That creeper literally nearly killed me. It's cool because we can just copy a new one. There you go. We have new totem of undying. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my god, we just found some diamonds. And I have a really, really weird idea now. So if I mine these diamonds, oh my god, I can't I can mine it with the diamond pickaxe. Okay. Look at this vein. Let's go, dude. I didn't have to say Gungang Yingang. I feel like the power of Gungang Yingang just runs in my veins. Yeah, literally eight diamonds. Oh my goodness. We gotta be careful with what we do because our brush is taking damage and so is our stamp. While mining for diamonds is cool. Instead of mining them, what if let's just make our own diamond block? Which is gonna take a while, it looks like. Bro, my hand is gonna- is literally crippled at this point. You know, it's gonna make this look like an actual diamond block, which now my memory is, like, failing me. I don't remember how a diamond block looks like, but I'm pretty sure it's something like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Done, boys. What is that? Oh? I am literally holding- Oh my god, wait, it's see-through. Of course, because I didn't get every single line. Oh my god, what if I place it? Okay, wait, if I place it, it's not see-through. That's so weird. Uh, yes, a diamond block. Let me just mine it real quick. <laughs> Can we actually just- Oh my god, wait, it works. Like, it's not even a scam. It actually works. Wait, we have nine diamonds. And if I just paste it, bro, bro, we literally just got more diamonds. Oh my God, pasting it right here and right there. Oh my nuts. We have 38 diamonds. I don't even have enough wood to, oh, I have an idea. <laughs> I'm trying to think, guys. Do we even need iron? Like, let's be honest. We don't. We have 45 diamonds plus this insane diamond pickaxe. It looks so cool, bro. I love it. Why play Minecraft with good textures when you can make your own, right? <laughs> so yeah, we don't even need this iron. Like, what if we could make custom items? Oh my goodness. Wait a second. I think I might have to try it. What if, gamers? We can literally almost create, like, our own thing. I actually want to make, like, our own sword. I don't know how good it's going to be, but literally, bro, let's just try it out. So I'm just making the hilt thingy, like, the wood part. Wait, it doesn't have to be out of wood. Okay, screw it. Well, I'm already doing it. Fill this bad boy in. What if I literally just... Oh my god, this is the worst line ever. Okay, dear lord, I'm sorry. Listen, bro, I'm trying. Every drawing, I'm like losing a little bit of confidence. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I know. That's, that's a good sword. Okay, wait. Oh! <laughs> oh my god. Shut the front door. Oh my goodness. Look at my painted sword of amethyst. I don't even know how this makes sense. Why update to 1.17 to mine real amethyst and somehow make make a sword out of it, even, even though you, I don't think you can, when you can just paint it, you know, in Minecraft. <laughs> Hold up. Wait a minute. Oh my god, perfect. There's some mobs right here. Okay, hold on. I have my uh, scuffed robber in my- Oh my god, there's so many mobs. <gasps> oh! oh my god, I almost just died. Bro, that was so scary. Okay, hold up. Where's- Okay, yes. Bonerman, come here. A worthy opponent. And bap. Okay, that was so easy. Just look at our items right now. Like, how? How is this real? I don't understand how this is real. Okay, hold on. Let's definitely get the balls out of here. But wait. Oh my goodness. Now that we know we can make custom items, literally out of whatever we want. Oh my god. Wait, what else do we want to make then? And finally, we're out of that stupid cave. Wait, are we literally back at spawn? <laughs> this is literally where we first started. I didn't even realize. Hello, Technoblade. Look. Okay, yeah, he does not want. He does not want to taste my amethyst sword. Guys, if you had the power to literally be able to paint any block into existence, what would you make? Like, what would you draw? Hello, cow. He's just looking at my items like, bro, how? With the power of Gungingang, that's how. I like how we just have like a normal axe and then boom, drawn pickaxe. Okay, but there you go. We have a butt ton of wood. Our stamp, the thing that we can copy items with, is about to break. So you know what? Let's make a new crafting table. Boom. And let's craft a new one of these. Boom. Wait, what? Why is it not working? Wait, what? It's literally not working yet. I've already crafted one. Oh no. Wait a second. Hold on. Are there any sheep nearby? There are. Yeet. Bah. Okay, there we go. We got our three wool that we need. Oh no, no, no. Gamers, what if we can't craft another brush? Wait, maybe I'm crafting the stamp wrong. I don't think I am. Please tell me it's gonna work. Please No. No, no. What? Why? Oh my god. It doesn't let me, gamers. It literally doesn't let me make another brush. Bro, what? I literally craft- You guys saw me craft it. And now it just doesn't work. 
bruh wait does that mean oh my god that means we literally have to use this wisely okay wait wait we gotta think we have a weapon boom there you go we have our dragon slayer i mean it's an amethyst sword but it's gonna have to do now we have to think of the best items that we can think of that will actually help us defeat the ender dragon well i just got an idea i see an enderman i'm gonna go and quickly make myself some diamond armor there you go boom bam bap everything except for the helmet i have an idea for the helmet boys we gotta paint ourselves some nice drip for our bald head even though i'm not bald anymore okay anyways it's about to be night time so we gotta be careful what if we make ourselves just the most overpowered bow i have two arrows we also need some cheese sticks aka blaze rods and some ender pearls but i think that's a good idea a god bow and some god apples custom god apples okay but first let's do the essential let's get this color wait are blaze rods more orange or yellow i think they're like both there you go i'm just gonna make like a piece of loaf and then fill it in this is the best cheeto you've ever seen okay let's no what i'm being attacked oh my god i think this is gonna have to do this is this is the cheeto this is the blaze rod done no no oh my god oh my <gasps> i got it i got the blaze rod oh <laughs> it just looks like a big cheeto it literally looks like a cheeto oh my god whoa 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 yes this amethyst sword is legit bro okay i'm not too war dude these phantoms are so annoying why oh my god stop please i need to use the stamp to duplicate the blaze rods oh my god dude i can't believe people actually voted for these mobs to be the ones to be added like why did phantoms have to be added they're literally the most annoying mob ever good thing i have this super cool robert to keep us alive thanks robert if you haven't already subscribed because of robert i don't know what will make you so no oh my god okay wait this is chaotic where is my drawing where's my pin okay my painting's over here it's worth two million leave me alone okay boom bruh stop these mobs are so annoying okay so we now have a total of five which is ten Ooh. Okay, we have 10 blaze powder. Boom. Okay, perfect. We have our final. Oh my god, more? Okay, no, I actually hate this, dude. This is so annoying. I'm just trying to freaking. Oh my god. Okay, hold on. I'm just literally gonna get enough sheep to make a bed. Finally. There you go. Yes. Burn, you nerds. Oh my god. I mean, I could have drawn my own bed, but nah. I feel like if I painted my own bed, it'd be super uncomfortable. All right, but there you go. We have the necessary blaze powder. Now we need. Oh, and wait, why didn't I just draw the eyes of Ender? I am so dumb. I promise you, I. <laughs> I'm actually just. I actually have two brains cells okay it's fine let's just make ourselves a god bow first then we can do the eyes of ender okay i'm not gonna lie uh this dirt is kind of throwing me off should i just paint another block maybe like oh yeah i have some andesite wait no the wool wait didn't i make a bed how do i have three st okay i'm so confused now gamers i don't even know what's going on all i know is i'm supposed to be using this very rarely and i'm just wasting a bunch of uses so for this bow what should it be what if we just make like a bro what if we make a diamond bow right so let's go something like that oh god i don't know if that looks good it looks more like a boomerang but shh Leave me alone. Okay, wait, yeah, I think this shape looks a lot better now. And, okay, that looks pretty good. But I'm not trying to make some measly little, like, derp bow. No, 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 no. I'm trying to make a actual god bow. Something that will literally one-shot the dragon. So, hold on. What if we get, like, this purple stuff? And then we go like this. Bro, this is gonna look so cool. Look at that. Oh, my God. This is gonna be the coolest bow. And then I gotta get white. Even if we can't see it, there you go. Make the string. Or, wait, should the string be golden? Oh, my God, yes. I'm gonna make a golden string. And then, screw it. Should we add some green? Green? Like, I don't know what the green would do. Pig, stop moving me. I'm, oh my God, the pig's moving me in the background. Okay, that's fine. I think that looks really, really cool. And boom. Oh my, wait, yo. Hey, yo, wait, what? It actually worked. God bow. You have painted an art piece worthy of the gods. Bro, are you sure about that? <laughs> I mean, listen, hey, hey, hey. If the gods think it's worthy, then that's fine. But uh, I don't know about that. I mean, it looks kind of cool. Honestly, yeah, no, it does look kind of sick. I, I'm literally holding it like a, like an instrument. It's really weird. Then again, it's not a bow, guys. It's a piece of art. And if you guys don't think it's good, then uh, maybe you just don't understand art. <laughs> Who put you on this planet? Who put you on the planet. Ugh. Okay, wait, wait. In all seriousness, we have two arrows. And while I would love to just shoot this pig, I think we need to save him. Now, we made the god bow here. I think maybe on like, I mean, it doesn't really matter which side. We need to use the rest of our stamp to find the stronghold. So, boom. Now, we need to make an eye of ender. Now, I feel like, oh no, this is gonna be so awful. Oh my god. Yeah, this is gonna be awful. I knew it. Bro, I'm trying to make a perfect so I can't make one. Oh wait, no, that's actually pretty good. Yo, yo, just when I thought I literally could not make one, I literally make one. This is is probably gonna be the best freaking circle i'm gonna make so let's just quickly fill it in good art takes time ladies and gentlemen you have to be one with the pixels okay honestly that's good enough it's a big green blob now if i just
just add black and then we do like the little eye slit kind of like that damn bro this is about to make me act up what okay anyways let's just move on from that yo this actually looks pretty good i just feel like i'm missing something maybe there's like purple like is there is there purple like right here i actually don't know guys i forgot listen i'm doing this based off memory i'm literally just trying my heart okay that's an eye of ender i don't care boom oh my god <laughs> Why is it so tiny? Oh my god, this is our eye of ender. It's actually pathetic. Why? Why did I think this would be a good idea? Okay, honestly, guys, I'm done. I'm done painting. Okay, maybe not, but I'm just really sad. I'm sad. I'm sad. That's a sad eye of ender. Hold on, we need to copy it and then paste it. Boom. And again. And then let's go again. And there you go. Oh my god, we have 12 Eye of Ender, and we no longer have the copying tool. Okay, and if I just throw one... Oh my god, there it goes, boys! And please drop it. Yes! We have our pebble again! Wait, where'd it go? Oh, wait, I think I picked it up. Oh, I picked it up. Oh my goodness, okay. We're literally pinning our way to victory. Okay, wait, 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 it just went down. It just went down. Did I just... Oh, I just picked it up again! Oh my goodness, okay. We gotta use this god bow, bro. I actually don't know how powerful the god bow is, but look at this mine with our amazing pickaxe! Bro, it's actually cracked. I'm so sorry, but it's, it's the best pickaxe I've ever made. Then again, it's kind of like... Like the only pickaxe I've actually painted before. We've drawn items, but like... Oh, wait. We're here. We're here. Oh, my goodness. Let's go. Wait. What? 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 I, I dug straight down into it. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. I gotta break this. I gotta break this. And oh, my God. We have enough. We have more than enough. Oh, my goodness. There you go. Yeet. Okay, I just wasted them. I, I hope I don't need them anymore, right? I, I don't think I do. We can literally paint one more item. That's it. Just one. And you know what? I think I know what I'm gonna make. Let's do this. Yeet. Okay, there we go. We're in the end. Oh, my goodness. We have to fight the Ender Dragon. Okay, we cannot fall off because I don't have any Ender Pearls. I could draw me some, but then again, hold up. We got an amethyst sword. And bap. Come on, come on. Oh my god, that was so easy. Okay, there you go. We at least have one in a pro now. To save us just in case we're about to die. Where's our pizza? There we go. Okay, we got our pizza. I'm honestly gonna have to do this the good old fashioned way, boys. Unless this bow just one shots the dragon. Bro, imagine I just called it. Okay, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. I have a good idea. Before we even do any of this, I don't know how much our brush can last, bro. We literally only have. Oh my god, it's about to die. Let's make ourselves a little hole. And okay, we're good. Okay, please don't break. Please don't break. Please don't break. I wanna make a god helmet and i also want to make a god apple okay okay wait it didn't break we still have it in our hand good let's just go ahead and make some squiggly thing okay that looks awful let's make the stem oh my god this looks like a pumpkin bro it literally looks like a grape okay hold on i make leaf leaf look good what does this actually look kind of good let's add some pink over here i get i don't really know what i'm doing now hopefully i'm not ruining it okay i think that i think that's amazing boom and oh my goodness boys enchanted amethyst apple oh my no, no 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 i can't eat it yet wait when i eat it it, <laughs> it has the golden apple particles. I want to eat it, but no. Not yet, boys. Let's get the balls out of here. And oh, no, 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 no. Hold on. Wait, I can still make my... No, it just broke. <gasps> my brush just broke. Oh, my God. I right clicked it on accident. Well, no helmet. Let's do this. Let's eat the enchanted amethyst apple. Oh, my God. We have strength three. Oh, my goodness. Okay, okay. Wait, this is actually lit. Strength three, right? Oh, wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, bro, chill. Yeah, easy. Two shot, baby. Okay. What if we literally shoot the dragon with a goggle? It's enchanted. It has no enchanted though. Okay, wait, hold on. He's coming down. Should I just shoot him now? Three, two, one, and yeet! Wait, what the? Oh my god, he's almost dead. Wait, he's almost dead. Oh my- Two shots! And we literally defeated the dragon! Oh my goodness. Boys, we didn't even have to use Robert. We didn't even have to use our friend Robert. Bruh. Well, that was a uh, pretty anticlimactic, but uh, easy at the same time. I guess that just means we're a good artist. And of course, if you guys enjoyed my artist skills or whatever, you should check out some other videos and make sure you like and subscribe, especially if you're new. Check out the other videos on the screen. I love you guys. Peace. Welcome to Minecraft where you can multiply items. In today's video, we're going to be able to take any item we want and multiply literally hundreds of times. How this works is that we'll be using a special crafting table to combine these items into super items and then multiply multiply them into legendary items. Trust me, you don't want to miss what they do. Can it be the dragon? What happens if I combine those straight off the bat, guys? We're going to be going straight for our first multiplied item, which is going to be the crafting table made out of crafting tables. And once we make that crafting table, we're going to be making literally over like 10 different items of just multiplied variants of tools, weapons, and even armor. So with all that being said, get ready for a lot of multiplied items with our first ones being the wooden pickaxe, stone pickaxe, iron pickaxe, and then finally the diamond pickaxe. So with all that being said, we definitely need to get a lot of wood, a lot of iron, a lot of diamonds, and literally everything in the game so we can multiply these items and make pretty much some of the best items in the game. And I'm not going to give it away right now, but pretty much the final item we're going to be multiplying, which is the armor, is literally one of the coolest things ever in Minecraft, like ever made. But before we get to that, let's go ahead and make some crafting tables. So I think to make the multiplier crafting table, we need nine crafting tables. And with the nine crafting tables, we can go ahead and make the multiplied table, which
which once played so we get a full on brand new crafting table that we can actually go ahead and start using with our wooden pickaxes so real quick I'm gonna go ahead and try to make three wooden pickaxes and I think this might be enough to go ahead and multiply the wooden pickaxes so with three wooden pickaxes and two sticks we should be able to get a wooden pick 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 oh gosh what a name three picks three times the mining I wonder if we can do better literally we're already getting inside the rabbit hole guys there are gonna be so many multiplied items today I probably should keep the stone pickaxe but just you wait till we get the stone pick 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 and then the iron pick 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 and then the diamond pick 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 and then I'm just gonna say pick 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 the entire video until we get to the bow 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 trident 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 sword 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 armor 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 even shield 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 so with that being said let's go ahead and mine some stone and get the stone pick 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 okay let's dig in a straight line right here it will just make a hole Oh, oh, that's so cool. What the heck? Okay, that is definitely way more than enough cobblestone. It's not the best pickaxe in the world, but it definitely gets the job done. What the heck? All right, so there's only one thing better than a wood pick, pick, pick. A stone pick, 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 pick. All right, two sticks. And then all we gotta do is put three stone pickaxes. And there we go. We get the stone pick, pick, pick. Hot to the touch. Ores are no match. But can we do it even better? So it's hot to touch. Wait, but it's stone. Oh, wait, I think I know what this means. So if we go into this cave real quick, it might actually auto smell everything. So I don't need coal anymore let's see if we can find some iron all right if i'm not mistaken i should get an auto smell here <gasps> it worked all right that's actually really useful so literally straight off the bat guys we now have auto smelting with the stone pick 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 which is definitely cool but it's still not good enough so i think we should go for the iron one next i have so many pickaxes in my hopper i got the wood pick 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 stone pickaxe and then the stone pick 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 go ahead and pick your favorite that was my joke for the day hope you hope you enjoyed that joke best joke in the world anyways let's go ahead and start mining i need to get enough iron so i can get the iron pick 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 and then we can finally get to the really good ones which are going to be the diamond multiplied items. Oh, what a good pickaxe. I'm not sure what the iron pick 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 does, so I guess we'll see once I make it. All right, so let's go ahead and make three iron pickaxes. Who needs a bucket when you have three iron pickaxes? There we go. Get the multiplied table. All right, and with these three iron pickaxes, we can go ahead and get the multiplied iron pickaxe, which says even more mining plus smelting. Okay, this pickaxe can't be beat, right? I'm going to assume that it's talking about the diamond pick pick pick, which I don't know what that does at all either. So holy... <laughs> What? Okay, that's actually really useful. Oh, it's water. Okay, that- No, 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 please, please. I only have one life. Please. No game, not right now. There's a literally zero chests. That was a scam. What the heck? Okay. Wait, so what happens if I dig straight down? Oh gosh, this might be a bad idea. Holy, this is insane. Okay. Oh, we found a cave. All right, that was easy. All right, so I don't really need iron anymore. The only thing I need now to make multiplied items is diamonds. So, uh, I'm just gonna kind of dig straight down with this thing. This is insane. Oh, literally right away. Okay, already, guys. No, no, no. No, no, only two diamonds. Okay. <laughs> no, come on. Literally, I just found the diamonds and already burnt them. Oh, come on. Really? All right. Okay, before I go a little bit deeper, I should probably definitely make some iron armor. Only two diamonds so far, though. I definitely need a lot more if I want to make the pick, pick, pick. Oh, wow. Um, okay. Literally two diamond veins right beside each other. Okay, I'm not going to make the mistake of mining this with this pickaxe again. Or should I? I might risk it. Honestly, I'm going to risk it. Why not? Oh, no. B bad risk. Bad risk. Okay, okay, okay. We're good. We're good. Um, I got all diamonds that way. We're good. We're good. Okay. Six diamonds in total. I should be fine for now. Let me just make sure they don't fall in lava. And I also got to get a water bucket very soon. Don't fall in lava. I mean... It could have been worse. Okay, we're good. All right, 10 diamonds. Not bad. All we got to do now is make three diamond pickaxes, get the multiplied table, and I think we should be good to finally make our next pickaxe, which is going to be the diamond multiplied pickaxe, which let's see how it looks like. Oh, okay. I completely forgot that this thing was rainbow. The pick, 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 <laughs> which uh, I love saying that word. And on the lore, it says it has a sense of randomness to it. This pickaxe is simply the best. And even though it looks like I have the whole collection now, there's literally even more multiplied pickaxes I can get. So we're we're only touching the surface. Oh, okay. Uh, just I was gonna test out the big axe, but we found diamonds on the way back. Uh, d wait, wait, what? Wait, I didn't mind gold. Wait, what? <laughs> Hold on. Wait, wait. So the pickaxe says it has a sense of randomness to it. Does that mean literally everything I mine is going to give me a random item? Oh, oh no. Okay, guys. Uh, I think I figured out how we're going to get a lot of the multiplied items. Wait, so with this many diamonds, I can go ahead and start making a lot of stuff. I think I might go try and multiply the diamond axe because if the pickaxe is this good, I'm really curious of all the rest of the items because right now we're literally just scraping the top of the bucket. Is that a phrase? I'm not 
even sure. I think I just made that up. Okay. <laughs> All right. So I think in total, we need three diamond axes. I think when we put a diamond axe here, I think we should be able to get. Oh, and there it is. The rainbow multiplied axe. And it says an axe to match with some magic skills. Interesting. A better weapon would be hard to come by. Okay. I'm getting way too OP right now. I now have a multiplied axe, a multiplied pickaxe. And I know I keep saying this, but literally guys, there are so many more items we have to get to that I'm kind of scared of how OP we're going to get by the end of this video. All right, let's head all the way back up. It's only been like two minutes and I already have two sacks of gold and 24 diamonds. What the heck? I can make so many things right now. So before anything, let's go ahead and try out this axe, axe, axe. Oh my gosh, wait, it gives you good items too. Okay, literally everything's blessed right now. <laughs> what the heck? We literally just got diamonds from chopping down trees. Wait, is that? Oh my gosh. Did we just get netherite from that? <laughs> what the heck? Okay, all right. So we now get netherite from literally chopping down trees. Not only is all mining blessed now, but also chopping down trees. I only got one netherite ingot, but that's still insane. It doesn't look like this has any other abilities besides just giving me good stuff from whenever I chop down trees. Never mind. Oh my gosh. Wait, what just happened? <laughs> I'm literally sending out little meteors. What? This video is a mess right now, guys. And we're not even done there. There's literally like seven more items. So just like that, we have four netherite ingots and 34 diamonds. What is going on right now in this game? All right, since we made an axe, we might as well multiply the sword next. All right, three diamond swords. I think that's all I need right now. Multiply table. And I think I'm just going to multiply it three times. I think this is how it works. Okay, and there we go. The sword, 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 the multiplied sword, a sword made out of swords. Anything strong just seems unnecessary. Oh my gosh. All right. Oh, oh, okay. Uh, so I can throw swords now. Okay, very nice. Uh, the, multiplying the swords has made me multiply my sword throwing skills. Very nice. Uh, oh, and it's a sword trick and two at the same time. This video is actually just too much. Oh, wait, what have I done? I just almost died there. I thought I had my water bucket at the right slot. Oh my gosh. Okay. Uh, we don't talk about that. That was literally the worst fail ever. Um, I don't know why I placed my anvil there, but you know what? I'm just going to grab this real quick. I got a gold ingot from an anvil. Uh, I'm literally just flabbergasted by this game mode right now. Also, my favorite word is flabbergasted. If you made it this far in the video, just comment down flabbergasted or comment down below your favorite item so far. Oh wait, a zombie. Okay. What if I throw the sword at it? I'm literally going to kill the dragon so quickly with this thing. All right. So what I think I want to make next is the triple multiplied bow, which is going to require me to get a lot of strings. So I'm probably just going to go ahead and strip mine until I find one. Oh, we found a mine shaft. All right. Perfect. Okay. So we're going to be needing a lot of string because the multiplied triple bow is not going to be the only bow we make today. We're going to be making a lot of multiplied items. And once we make those multiplied items, we're going to multiply those items with multiplied items. So it's literally going to be a multiplied exception. All right. So in total, we have 24 string, which might be enough for now. We might as well go ahead and try to make the multiplied bow. So I think for this, I'm going to be needing three bows and that should be it. All right, multiply table. And uh, to make this, I think we put the bows like that. And then with three string, we should be able to get, and there it is, the multiplied bow, bow, bow. A fully automatic bow. Surely this has to be the limits of Minecraft, right? I I'm, I'm going to guess probably not. This video is getting out of hand right now. I'm not even sure if we can make a multiplied fishing rod. And if we can, I'm going to think we're going to become Spider-Man or something. From what it sounds, it's probably a machine gun. Here we go. Yep, it's a machine gun. All right. Oh my gosh. Oh, wait, we can pick up the arrows. We have unlimited arrows now. The dragon fight is about to be so hectic. What the heck? So with that bow being made, I think we multiplied all the items we could. And now we're going to be making multiplied items made out of multiplied items. So I'm thinking about it right now. That is going to take a lot of diamonds. So I definitely got to find as many diamonds as I can right now, which actually isn't a problem because I legit just have to strip mine. And just in three, two, one, we're going to be finding diamonds right about now. Yep, there we go. But as weird as it sounds, it might be faster just to chop down some trees. So I'm going to do that first. We have a lot of stuff, but we do got to make multiplied items out of multiplied items. So we might as well start chopping down some trees. And I'm just going to go ahead and destroy the whole forest. Oh my gosh. Holy, go on my minions. Go blow up and do your thing against the forest. Go, go, go. And from that, we literally have 10 netherite ingots, which if I'm not wrong, if I make a shield and then combine it with netherite, this should be good enough for me to finally make the shield, shield, shield or multiplied shield, which... Uh, doesn't really make sense with the netherite, but I'm not really complaining. And it says impenetrable 
unbreakable, unbreaking. Everything you could ask for in a shield. Ignore that typo. Oh, this actually looks pretty cool. Hey, look at that thing. Oh, so it's like a wither shield. Interesting. Oh, wait, I just remembered about one item. So before I make that, I should probably make a double chest because right now I am struggling to make everything I can. So I definitely need to get into the nether very soon. But before I do that, I'm going to real quick store everything we can. So we're going to be making a multiplied trident. And to make a trident, we actually use the multiply table to multiply swords with sticks. And just like that, we got trident, 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 which says it's basically just a bunch of swords anyways. I think we can improve it though. So I think that's the multiply table telling us to try to multiply multiplied items with multiplied items. Did that make sense? Probably not, but watch this. Okay, so what does this do? Is it just a trident? Oh, oh, it's just a really good trident. Nice. Uh, I'm so sorry. Oh gosh. Okay. All right. Well, um, we now have a lot of swords, so I'm kind of curious. We might as well go ahead and make a multiplied sword, sword, sword. So if we make three swords and then combine these three swords, we're going to be multiplying it even more and finally getting a sword, sword, sword X36. How many swords can you fit in a sword? Whatever that number is, this can fit more. So we're actually in the perfect spot to test this bad boy out because we have an iron golem right here. So when we left click, Oh, okay. Yeah, I've gotten this item in the past and this thing is actually sick. Oh my gosh. Go swords, go. Wait, what if I right click? Oh, okay. No, 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 no. Okay, okay, okay. I know. Look, 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 Iron Golem. I only have one life. I'm really trying to do this challenge in one try. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Holy, you have so much health, Iron Golem. Oh, we killed him. So now that we have a multiplied, multiplied sword, we definitely got to make the multiplied, multiplied pickaxe, multiplied, multiplied axe, and definitely get into the nether to get some blaze rods. I feel like getting the blaze rods are going to be very easy this video. I also completely forgot to make the multiplied armor, but the multiplied armor actually takes a lot of diamonds. So I'm going to wait a little bit to make that. All right. So the next thing I think we're going to be making is the multiplied pickaxe made out of multiplied pickaxes. I guess I'm going to be making a lot of pickaxes. So, all right. So we just made a nine pickaxes, which I think should be enough. All right, multiply table. And now all we got to do is make a lot of pickaxe pickaxes. So one, two, and with the final multiplied pickaxe, I think this should be enough to make a multiplied and multiplied pickaxe. I'm saying pickaxe so many times this video, but you know what? I don't mind because with these pickaxes, we get, oh my gosh, that's big. Okay. We get the pick, pick, pick X36. When three picks just isn't enough, the ultimate pick is yours. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm going to save this pickaxe right there. We definitely used it a lot. Okay, so it actually doesn't mind very quickly. Hold up. Wait, the pick, pick, pick does better than the pick, pick, pick X36. Okay, what does this do then? Oh, yeah, I completely forgot that I did this. Oh, yeah, okay. Um, So we literally can just scaffold anywhere now. Oh, my gosh. I literally can just control stone to be anywhere I walk. What about when I mine ores? Oh, okay, wait. I think I might know what this is, guys. So when we mine coal, we're going to be getting a brand new item called the coal cannon. And I think when we right-click the coal cannon, I should probably make a lot of space because this could kill me. Oh, and more explosions, guys. Yep, it wouldn't be an extra story video without explosions. So that's what we call a coal cannon. So I'm going to assume that every ore that we mine is going to give us a different special item. So now I got to mine everything I see. What does iron give us? Oh, steel golem. Okay, we, we now have an army. Okay. Oh, they're all dying. Okay, you know what? Soldiers, I'm so sorry. Have a great day. Oh, look at them go. They're so beat up. I'm so sorry, guys. Hopefully they're subscribed right now. Oh, wait, and gold. What does gold give us? Oh my gosh, we're getting way too OP, guys. We are getting way too OP. So gold ore literally gives us a stack of golden apples. What the heck? All right, so we did coal, iron, gold. I need to find diamonds and I need to find redstone now. Okay, we finally found some redstone. Pick, pick, pick X36. So with the redstone, we get electric dust. So the electric dust does nothing when I place it. So I'm gonna assume that I have to wait to use this until I fight the dragon. So I'll save it right there. Okay, we finally found diamonds. Now to see what we get from the diamond. Holy that that was a lot of diamonds that came out there. Oh gosh, guys, I remember this. The diamond laser. Let's just say, guys, this is uh, definitely a little bit OP. I'm only going to use one because I definitely want to save these for the dragon. Watch this. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm going to use one more because that's actually sick. Oh! So I'm going to go ahead and put that right there. We got some diamond lasers. We got some electric dust and we got some coal cannons. This dragon literally stands no chance. I have so many OP multiplied items and now I have even better items from the multiplied items. L like, look at that. Literally unlimited golden apples. I really don't want the golden apples, but I'm going to mine them either way because, you know, it, it just looks OP and I like OP things. So I think we should go ahead and make the next item now, which I think is going to be the Axe X36, which oddly enough, we don't have enough diamonds for that. So I should probably start mining again. Also, I forgot to mention, guys, I'm not 
actually the fastest obsidian miner in Minecraft. And when I mine obsidian, I even get stuff like diamonds. It's crazy. <laughs> this is so cool. So because we need diamonds, I decided to real quick come up here. And why not? Let's go ahead and do this the old fashioned way. Oh, look at them go. Holy, okay. That, the, these videos are just getting way too crazy. Okay, so from that, did we get any diamonds? We got netherite. But where are the diamonds? I definitely need diamonds. Come on, game. I have 11 netherite ingots from that. What the heck? All right, so we definitely have enough diamonds now. So I think the next thing we're going to be making, guys, is nine diamond axes that we're going to be multiplying onto another multiplied item, which is going to be the multiplied multiplied axe. So if that didn't make sense, don't worry. I'll be done very soon. All right, just like that, we got three multiplied axes. And I think with these multiplied axes, all we got to do is place one more stake and then we get... Holy, that is huge. No! Oh, I almost lost that. The multiplied crafting table. No. Okay, I'm gonna make one real quick, guys. I cannot be taking L's like that. Anyways, just like that, we got the multiplied axe, 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 x36, which says one axe to roll them all. The ultimate axe is yours. And I'm gonna guess this is a more OP version of the axe, axe, axe. So let's see what it does. Oh, um, <laughs> okay. I somewhat remember this thing, but it literally shoots triple axes. So I think what we need next is gonna be the bow, 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 x36. I definitely need some more bows to make the multiplied, multiplied bow. All right, we got a mine shaft. I just gotta get some string. All right, so to make a double multiplied bow, I'm gonna be needing nine times three strings. So in total, I need 27 strings. I'm almost there. All right, so we definitely have enough now, but I'm gonna have to make a lot of bows. I think in total, we only need six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And now with these six bows, I kind of forgot how it was made. I think it was like this. Oh yeah, okay, it was like that. All right, all right, that's one more bow. And so to make this, I think it's three bows right there. And with three more string, oh, okay. All right, that is one big bow. We get the final multiplied bow, the bow, 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 X36. Another classic bow on this channel. What's better than a fully auto bow? Shooting out fully auto bows from your bow. It sounds a little bit redundant, but at the same time, I'm not complaining because I literally have a sword shooting out swords. All right, so with the bow, 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 X36, when I right click, Oh, it'll literally shoot out bows shooting out bows. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I don't know if the dragon is going to survive this. Literally, I have the ultimate arsenal right now. I think the next item I'm going to be going for is definitely going to be the Trident X36. And then we'll finally be getting to the multiplied armor and the multiplied multiplied armor, which is going to cost us a lot of diamonds. But fingers crossed, it should definitely be worth it. Another Trident right there and final Trident. And with this, we should get the final multiplied Trident. And with these three multiplied Tridents, we should be getting a literal trident multiplied out of multiplied tridents. And there we go, guys. Look at that majestic trident. A trident, trident, trident X36 imbues its owner with supreme power over the oceans. All these items look so OP right now. <laughs> oh my gosh. I guess we might as well try it right now. All right, let's try to throw it. <laughs> guys, let me know in the comments down below. Is this way too OP? Guys, I I'm floating. Um, guys, I'm, I'm literally flying. I, I'm, I'm flying through the world right now. <laughs> oh my gosh. I kind of forgot how good this thing was. Holy. Okay, with this being done, I think we definitely should start going into the nether, but I should probably try not dying. This is definitely probably our best weapon so far and definitely my favorite one also so far. So with all those multiplied items being made, I think it's finally time, guys, to go ahead and get some obsidian and actually get some blaze rods. All right, just like that. 13 obsidian. All right, let's go in. All right, where is a fortress? Oh, wait, guys, I just realized I could just do this. Oh my gosh, this is so overpowered. Okay, the nether portion of this challenge is a literally not a challenge anymore. We are just gonna scaffold throughout the whole nether. Oh, and there it is, guys. Okay, we finally found the fortress. All I gotta do now is just get some blazes, get the blaze powder, then get some ender pearls, and then we should be good to start heading to the stronghold. This might be a bad idea, but I'm just gonna go ahead and use this trident. Oh gosh, okay. Oh, we got a blaze rod. Guys, this trident is so overpowered. We are shooting so many things right now. All right, in total, we have six blaze rods. We just need one more. All right, that should be good. Seven blaze rods. I don't need any of these to multiply, and we definitely have a majority of the multiplied items right now. All we need to get now is literally the multiplied armor, and for that, we definitely need to get a lot more diamonds. So that's definitely the next goal right now. All right, where are some hoglins? I definitely need some ender pearls. Do you trade? Okay, we found one. Wait, wait, do these guys trade golden apples? Hey, buddy, do you like golden apples? <gasps> he takes golden apples. Yes. Okay. There you go, buddy. Okay. I'm literally going to throw this hoglin. Like, uh, let's do, let's give him 50 golden apples and see what happens. So the last piglin spot didn't really work out, but I think these guys might be done just about now. So, uh, let's kill them the old fashioned way. Please be some underpearls. I really hope so. Please, 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 please. That was definitely one brutal way of killing them, but we did get some underpearls, so I'm not complaining. Okay. So, uh, 16 underpearls. That's all we need right now. And just like that, 14 eyes of ender. All that we need to get now is just the multiplied armor, which I might as well go 
ahead and make one piece right now. So I think the easiest multiplied armor piece is going to be the boots. But even then, the boots is going to take so many diamonds to make. But either way, it's going to be worth it because with four diamond boots, we can multiply these to become the rainbow boot boot boots. That That's so hard to say. What the heck? Which is holy. Okay, projectile protection 10, protection 10, thorns 10, and unbreaking 10. And look at those beautiful rainbow boots. Oh my goodness. Oh wait, and we get jump boots. Oh, that's sick. I'm going to assume that the devs made the dragon a lot harder this time because we are definitely very overpowered right now. So, uh, how did I do that? Oh my gosh. Okay, good thing I have extra obsidian. That was, that was kind of a new move by me. All right, let's go inside. All right, and we are back. Okay, cool. So, easiest way getting out, probably this way. All right, up we go. And we are back on the surface. I know of one way that's going to be very easy for us to get diamonds, and that is legit just me spamming this axe and getting all the diamonds I can. So, with that being said, guys, give me one second. I'm about to blow up a whole forest, and then, uh, this should be enough diamonds. Holy diamonds. Okay. Actually, we might have enough already for another multi armor piece. All right. So five diamond helmets, one multiply table. And with this multiply table, we should be able to make one of the final multiplied items, which is going to be the rainbow multiplied helmet, helmet, helmet. And yet again, we get projectile protection 10, protection 10, thorn 10, and a breaking 10. So uh, who needs an iron helmet when you get the super rainbow helmet, which is going to give us holy, okay, haze three, which I really don't need because I already have pretty good stuff. But either way, like I can swing so fast now. Oh my, okay. Okay, we might have enough now to make the pants. So I'm gonna real quick, seven diamond leggings. And with this, we should be able to multiply them into the rainbow multiplied legging, legging, leggings, which yet again, same main chance. We already know the whole story. But what potion effect am I gonna get from this one? Interesting, we get speed from this one. All right, I mean, I'll take it. All right, it's time to destroy some more force. Here we go. Holy, my inventory is a mess. Okay, we definitely have enough diamonds now though. All right, so the final armor piece we need is just eight diamond chest plates. And with these eight diamond chest plates, we get the final piece, which is the rainbow chest plate, chest plate, chest plate. Yet again, protection 10, very overpowered. And this should complete the full set. Oh gosh. And when putting it on, we get infinite regeneration just to top it off. We're full protection 10. And all that's left to do right now is get to the stronghold, make our final multiplied set, and see how quick we can kill this dragon. So we gotta go straight that way. And there's no easier way to go than going with the trident. Oh gosh, look at us go. Oh my gosh. And we're literally in the clouds. All right, I'm just gonna go as far as I can right now. Oh gosh. Oh, a core reef. All right. Uh, I have under. Oh, wait, it went back. Wait, low key, guys. I could probably easily find it doing this way. Okay, if it went straight back this way, I'm gonna real quick attempt to see if I can find it caving like this. Hold up. Oh, we found it. Okay, that actually worked. What? Oh my. This is definitely the goofiest challenge we've ever done. Everything is so overpowered, and we still haven't even made the final item yet, which we'll be getting to very soon. So don't worry. Oh, and there we go. All right. All right, 12 eyes of under. And before I go in, guys, I think it's time. So the final multiplied craft for this challenge challenge, guys, is actually going to require me to literally go into the end completely naked without armor. And even though that sounds really dangerous right now, especially with all these weapons that can potentially kill me, it's because with these items, we're going to be making the multiplied armor, 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 which is going to be the armor, armor, armor X36, which like the lore says is the ultimate sacrifice. I'm going to be going in here without any armor for the largest reward. I don't want to spoil anything. I know what this is going to be. And either way, Way every time I am just flabbergasted of what is possible in Minecraft. Anyways, I'm completely naked. We got this. One life, one dragon. Okay, Ender Pearl, let's do that real quick. Oh my. Okay, watch this. And just like that, guys. Oh my gosh. We are now inside of a mech and we are officially a literal robot in Minecraft. And watch this. We have a mecha cannon and a mecha sword. So now that we have a mecha cannon, we can literally shoot explosions anywhere we aim and this is going to be the way that we're going to break these end crystals. Welcome to probably the craziest Minecraft bite you've ever seen. Okay, I think that may be all of them. Oh, no, there's one more. Okay, final one. There we go. What a mess of a game right now. But honestly, this is so cool. Whew, okay, that could be bad. Now, let's try to end this with one of the mech's final abilities, which is going to be the self-destruct button emergency use only. Using this skill will cause all the mechs in the game to explode. So, with that being said, I'm going to get out. Okay, I have the nuke ready. Let's go, go, go. Go, go, it's about a nuke. Oh gosh, it's spinning, it's spinning. Oh my gosh, I did so much damage. No, the mech's gone. All right, we gotta do the rest of this now with the rest of the items we have. So, damn lasers. Let's go. Oh, no, I missed. Oh, that, that, that was a little bit of a scam. What about the coal cannon? Please hurt the dragon. Please hurt the dragon. It's so far away. I gotta get closer. Oh, it's doing damage. Oh, wait, this might be the final hit, guys. This might be it, guys, with these swords. Oh, no, I can't hit it. Okay, what about this? Oh, gosh, wait. Oh, yeah. Okay, the trident is literally the best item in the game. What the heck, guys? And before you guys click off the video, I just want to mention right